P. Shashi. I am part of People's Solidarity Concerns in Bangalore. We are also part of National Solidarity Forum, which is a network, various organizations all, all over the country, which has initiated various actions on Kandamal. And as you are aware, so much of violence in Kandamal in 2008, August 25th, uh, was the culminating point. As a part of series of uh, communal violence, uh, more than 300 churches and worship places have been demolished. More than 6,000 families have been uh, attacked. Around 56,000 people have been uh, displaced. Several educational institutions have been attacked and looted by the Sangparivar. Entirely the attacks on the Dalit and Adivasi Christians. And this has been a shame on the democracy of India. Many human rights activists have been involved in this uh, country on this issue. And many activists are planning for uh, uh, observing the Kandamal Day on August 25th, on 2014. We request you to observe Kandamal Day and demand justice. Today, only one person who is responsible for violence in Kandamal is in jail today. At the same time, so many people have been exposed to violence, destruction, looting and rapes also in Kandamal. But at the same time, all the people who are responsible for violence are going scot-free. And uh, there are innocent people. There are seven innocent people in jail today. Several other people have been charged different kind of charges by police cases and all that, including uh, UAPA, which is a draconian law, Unlawful Activities Prevention Act, which activists have been uh, asking for the removal. So there is no justice which is being given uh, to the victims of Kandamal, even today, after several years of Kandamal, incidents of Kandamal. So we request you to observe Kandamal Day on this year, on August 25th, uh, 2014. It is too important that we join together, all activists and human rights activists, all groups, anti-communal forces, secular groups all over the world, to observe this day, August 25th, uh, 2014, as Kandamal Day, so that no such violence takes place in history tomorrow, in, not just in India, anywhere in the world. Thank you.